Provo Power is the largest municipal power system in Utah, and they're moving towards being more sustainable. Carly Wasserlein went to the energy department to find out how close the city is to that goal. In May, the Provo City Council made a decision that was a little bit shocking. On May 5th, 2020, Provo City approved a motion to switch Provo Power to 60% green renewable energy by 2030. We are close to 50%. Sustainability can be tricky to navigate, but Travis Ball, the director of Provo Power, shed some light on the subject. But we also decided to get rid of some of our coal resources and replace that with more sustainable um, solar power. Provo Power built a four megawatt solar plant in Spanish Fork and are building an 80 megawatt plant north of Mona in conjunction with a few other cities. The difficulties is every time you build something that is intermittent, like a wind or a solar plant, you have to have something that backs it up. So in order to not leave Provo in the dark, Provo Power needs sources of energy that are a little bit more reliable than solar and wind. We purchased a natural gas plant up in West Valley that was about 200 megawatts um, that can start very quickly to back up any of our intermittent power supplies. Brigham Young University has done its part in helping Provo reach its goal. And part of that we're counting as a green resource is the combined heat and power is considered to be a green resource. After the solar plant near Mona is built, Provo Power is expecting to be at or near 51% green renewable energy, which is on track for its goal of 60% by 2030. Provo Power is on the lookout for more opportunities for solar power and are closely watching the technological advancements in the battery sector. Reporting for Universe Live in Provo, I'm Carly Wasserlein. Thanks, Carly. For more information, visit provopower.org.